FNN. The Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN. Headline News Update. Hello, everyone. Hope everyone had a good weekend, long weekend. We're looking at the Dow this Tuesday, the very last day of May. We're looking at May the 31st. <clears throat> We've got the Dow down 324 at 32,892. That's spiral up to the 50-period exponential moving average in gray leg A yesterday on Friday. That was it. For me, it was a, not that we're complaining. We've been long, so, but it was a big surprise. Just the, the amount of buying that came in. Now, we've given back a chunk today. High was 33,160, just under the high of Friday, which was uh, 33,213. <clears throat> Excuse me. So you can expect that there should be a peak A here. You can expect even a two-day pullback. But I suspect that we are going to see at least a test of that 50-period moving average again. That's going to be the big test. Is that going to tell us that we can go much higher? I'll talk about that in my show coming up, the Tiger Technicians Hour, at 10 o'clock Eastern Time. Uh, but right now we've got the uh, we've got the 10 o'clock. Tiger Financial News Network update. We're looking at the, uh, should be a down date. The SP is down 46 at 41.12. Had a spectacular move on Friday to continue that move up. The QQQ is also taking a bit of a breather. Uh, we're looking at the QQQ, the NDX 100 trading vehicle, down 350 <clears throat> at 305.40. Uh, yes, very good move. It isn't as good looking as the other two uh, indices, but. Pretty decent rally from the 280 low. The IWM, the Russell 2000, uh, pulling back as well, down 260 at 186. <clears throat> Didn't quite get to the 50-period moving average, but that was a really nice break from 168 to the 187-ish area. Now we're looking at the gold, and gold is, in fact, pulling back a bit. It's down 8 at 18.49. The dollar is holding quite well, actually. It is up 59 ticks at 101.94. It's really crude oil that we're looking at. Crude oil is up $3.45 at 118.50. Touched 119.98 in the continuous contract leg. He went right to the Fibonacci 161.8 uh, uh, expansion. We'll see whether it can go much higher than that over here. And we're looking at the TLT, which is bonds. Our bonds are down sharply, down 253 at 116.56, meaning that yields are once again off to this peak T in the day of the TLT. Yields are going up. I'll be back for the Tiger Technicians Hour. I hope you can stay. Check out my, my daily newsletter. 